I'm Greg Dierman, Group Engineering Lead at Palantir, and today I'll be discussing Apollo, Palantir's platform for continuous deployment across all environments. We built Apollo to bring the convenience and stability of SaaS where no SaaS has gone before. From submarines to satellites, private clouds, and on-premise data centers, Apollo enables the secure, seamless delivery of software across any environment, anywhere on Earth. This flexibility enables us to meet our partners where they are, wherever they are, and in turn empowers them to reach further. When we launched Gotham in 2008, cloud computing was in its infancy. Most enterprise software was still installed in customer-owned hardware in their own data centers, meaning upgrades were relatively infrequent and manual. By the time we launched Foundry eight years later in 2016, the software landscape had changed dramatically. The cloud was discussed as a singular entity with a singular grip on enterprise software. Companies rapidly embraced the SaaS model, microservice architecture, and CICD for the ability to push constant granular updates to their production environment. Because of this, commercial cloud providers were entering a heyday of hyperscale growth and adoption. However, five years later, there is no single cloud. Instead, organizations are looking up and seeing a sky full of clouds, some public, some private, and many that are hybridized, and this number is only increasing. Some government customers require their software to run in purpose-built government or classified clouds that live separately from standard public cloud infrastructure such as the case with the U.S. government's FedRAMP impact level accreditation programs. We've also seen stringent data protection regulations put in place by national governments, particularly in Europe with GDPR. This has resulted in enterprise software frequently needing to be hosted in country. Simultaneously, large companies are increasingly moving to private clouds and returning to on-premise for security, data privacy, or financial reasons. Together, this cloud fragmentation has narrowed the opportunities available to companies relying on traditional SaaS architecture. These companies are left to stagnate, unable to evolve alongside their customers or support robust product growth. To keep up with expanding delivery environments, some organizations decide to build continuous deployment capabilities in-house. While this is certainly possible, doing so pulls valuable resources away from innovation. As time is wasted, cobbling together a set of open source CI/CD tools that were designed for a singular cloud world. You need to keep your engineers spending their creative energy on building new capabilities for your customers, not figuring out how to deploy and operate those capabilities. You need an operational story for a disaggregated deployment model that doesn't require you to scale your headcount in order to scale your business. That's where Apollo comes in. Apollo is an orchestration engine for the enterprise, enabling continuous deployment, configuration management, and central software operations across these many cloud and on-prem environments. Apollo employs a number of different concurrent processes, including version management, advanced rollout strategies, and release promotion to ensure platforms stay up to date and operational 24 seven. With Apollo, you can release new capabilities, deploy them at scale, compose them into novel platforms, de-risk releases, and rapidly resolve problems as they arise. Having deployment health and continuity on a single pane of glass gives engineers a common interface to handle risk management concerns unique to each environment. Here's how it works. Most software companies have already adopted containers and have a continuous integration pipeline for their software development lifecycle. Let's add Apollo. First, you define the capabilities and configuration of each service you want to run and package it into a distributable format, a standard OCI container image. This framework does not require you to make code changes. The Apollo Hub is the central environment containing the Apollo software catalog, orchestration engine, and control panel for managing your software installations across the environments in your fleet. Within this hub, you simply register new versions of your services. Your code and software always stay within the existing source control and artifact repositories. Next, there is a deployment platform that runs within each environment you want to deploy and manage software within. This is a set of software that sits on top of Kubernetes, but also supports a containerless world. The deployment platform within each environment connects back to the Apollo Hub, reporting the current state of the environment. It then receives updates to the target state of each service as upgrades or configuration changes become available and meet the constraints declared by both services and the environment. Apollo is built to power workflows at scale. So as you deploy to more environments, your engineers stay focused on shipping new capabilities and not the mechanics of how those capabilities get deployed or upgraded. Different environments have different risk tolerances when it comes to software updates. For instance, you'll want to roll out new features to canary environments first before moving those same updates to classified networks or to critical edge hardware that are harder to operate within. 
Apollo facilitates software stability across these different environments by using a concept called release channels. Environments can subscribe to a release channel in accordance with their individual risk tolerance and appetite for new features. Once pushed via release channel, Apollo enables the evaluation and rollouts through a powerful suite of tools to help operators understand the risks associated with each pipeline, surface problems, and ship code better. As new opportunities require your software to be deployed across new cloud regions, cloud providers, and on-prem environments, Apollo enables your business to deploy software where it's needed. Your software engineers can continue to focus on the product and not on building for specific environments. Managing incremental installations of software are treated no differently than your first development and production environments. Your software engineering teams rely on the same mechanics for how their software gets delivered. Apollo makes it possible to take the same approach to continuous delivery across different security or classification boundaries by enabling you to deploy an Apollo hub within each network boundary. Each network hub is responsible for managing the environments on that network. This compliance-aware change management enables Apollo to centrally manage services and environments across different compliance regimes, empowering seamless operations across highly regulated business environments. Apollo effectively removes the deployment environment as a constraint, enabling engineers to focus on velocity and application code. They write code once that works for all customer environments. Ultimately, this approach brings more capabilities to customers faster, supercharging your growth by bringing homogeny to an increasingly heterogeneous world.